two and a half miles this time then, so a long while on the flat. And four year olds and upwards this time. Highly minded at the top for C D J Liggett. Charming humour for David Hooley, Yucatan Peninsula for Craig Allen, Wizard or Wizard for Martin Lidham, Viva Cadiz or Paul Rhodes, Star Deli, Alex Cherry has also got Tikiti Namika, Devil in a New Dress and the Zigama for Darren Thompson, give me some candy for Craig Allen, ahead by Century and jump to Mexico, Leon Van Rensburg, Eagle Feathers, Martin Lidham, Dia Shana, Sister for Graham Clutterbuck and Vinnie Gerrard's got the bottom pair, Darwin Starlet and Tampa Bay General, so 16 of them then for this two and a half mile up, and... At least a couple of times around on the foot, and they're all installed, ready to go. And away they go then. And who's going to be the first one to show these potential Ascot Gold Cup horses, I suppose, from some of the big stables, the smaller stables. We'll be looking at some of these running around Walkhampton in the All Weather Championship 0 to 70 races, so it could be quite interesting this one. And Tampa Bay General is in the lead by a couple of lengths to Eagle Feathers in second place. Then comes Viva Cadiz in third, and the rest of them are pretty much in a clump. It's hard to separate the current order. So the pace then is pretty hot, I think, for a two and a half miler. And Tampa Bay General is the one that's setting it from Eagle Feathers in second. Those two have broken away from the pack. There's a gap of about two lengths then to that pack who are headed by Highly Minded with Viva Cadiz and Takiti Namika also close up and towards the back the Leon Van Rensburg pair are both out of the back jump to Mexico and ahead by Century but it's Tampa Bay General who's clearing the lead then with two miles to go leads by two lengths to Eagle Feathers in second and then Highly Minded in the blue and green is third Viva Cadiz over on that far side is just about showing him forth with Takiti Namika in the orange leaves his next looking through the field the one grey I think is one of Darren Thompson's it might be devil in a new dress or it could be Zagama that's his other one we'll find out later on they're pretty closely together in the order so it's difficult to tell from the graphic at the top but it's Tampa Bay General who's in the lead anyway by two lengths to Eagle Feathers in second and highly minded now a clear third then comes to Kichi Namika and Viva Cadiz and then Devil in a New Dress and Dilshana sister with Yucatan Peninsula give me some candies also trying to make a bit of a forward move looking towards the back wizard and the Leon Van Rensburg pair of the back three but it's Tampa Bay General who's clearing the lead has been throughout still leads by two lengths to Eagle Feathers in second and highly minded third Yucatan Peninsula is the one that's staying particularly wide on the track but it's still close up and Leon Van Rensburg tells me that the turns on this course don't cause any problems anyway so it's one of the tracks where you can get away with a bad draw so you're not going to do Yucatan Peninsula too much harm being wide on the track but it's Tampa Bay General leads by two then as they come up past the big screen past the winning post and a circuit they go with Tampa Bay General having led all the way so far. Eagle for Feathers is second and then Highly Minded is third. Star is just about showing fourth from stablemate Takichi Namika. Yucatan Peninsula Wizards also making a bit of a forward move. Looking towards the back ahead by Century is still the back marker and the stable companion of the leader. Darwin Starlet is also out the back as well. But Highly Minded has now come through to challenge for the lead. Tampa Bay General just still holding that lead though on the inside. Highly Minded then in the blue and the green on is in second but just about forward in ahead now then from Eagle Feathers and Zigama then comes Takiti Manika and Yucatan Peninsula jump to Mexico's move forward they're beginning to bunch now behind the leading pair and it's still highly minded in Tampa Bay General Eagle Feathers being pushed along on the inside to keep his place jump to Mexico is the one that's really come through well now Zigama makes a forward move with six furlongs to go and Zigama has come through to quickly take it up so Zigama now has gone a length clear of highly minded in second then comes Tampa Bay General Viva Cadiz is still going well Eagle Feathers has now got a bit of a second wind and appears to be still in contention Wizard has dropped right back though Star Deli is the new back marker but it's Zigama who's in the lead then with four and a half furlongs to go Zigama three in a line Tampa Bay General Viva Cadiz and highly minded now around the outside Yucatan Peninsula starts to make its move ahead by Sentry is trying to cover that the Grey's Devil in a new dress that one's trying to go with them as well but it's Yucatan Peninsula who's hit the front as they've been in this sweeping turn into the straight then it's Yucatan Peninsula in the lead being given a hard ride by the jockey on the outside Tampa Bay General's on the rail Viva Cadiz is third then Dyashan sisters come from absolutely nowhere into fourth place the early leaders beginning to drop away Yucatan Peninsula's in the lead Viva 
looking this Tampa Bay general trying to sneak on Diashana's sister is coming through between the two of them ahead by center and jumps to Mexico with work to do it's still Viva Cadiz then as they come down towards the final further Viva Cadiz from Diashana's sister who looks to be going really well in second gap back to Yucatan Peninsula now looks beaten in third it's Viva Cadiz on the inside it's Diashana's sister closest to us and Diashana's sister is beginning to get up Diashana's sister now by a head by a neck by half a length by a length that's the line Diashana's sister don't see Viva Cadiz in second and head by center is third then Yucatan Peninsula and jumps to Mexico go and all the way back to Takita Namika and Dinah Shana's sister has taken it and Graham Clutterbuck said to me yesterday that he thought he might have got himself a group one horse for next season and I wonder if that's the one he's referring to if it isn't he's got two so Dyer Shana's sister takes it for Graham Clutterbuck. Viva Cadiz second for Paul Rhodes. A good showing so far for Paul on his comeback. Ahead by Century, Leon Van Rensburg was third. Yucatan Peninsula was fourth for Craig Allen. And Jump to Mexico was fifth for Leon Van Rensburg.